Hi everybody. Welcome to Minecraft Land Party. Um, I'm gonna do something today. It's got me kind of nervous. Oh, gonna fight the wither. Yeah. So I don't really need to carry those with me. Um, compass will be useful getting back home. I don't need. Probably don't need water. Let's go. Let's go get some buckets. I'm gonna do some prep. I'm not gonna make you watch all of it. All right. Got some buckets for some milk. Should I just bring that as well? Um, probably won't need all that. But going on the better safe than sorry sort of thing. Oh, wait. Important piece of what we need. Need some soul sand. Okay. Um. Okay, so I need some regeneration potions. All right, I, I, I'm going to bring some regeneration potions. Uh, healing. Uh, sure, why not? Let's bring those. I got these strength potions. I think will be useful. I'll have to rearrange all this in a useful manner. Don't need fire resistance, and I don't need water breathing. And over here, I have, oh, I thought I had, oh, it's in the ender chest, of course. I have, I have some uh, golden apples, and I'm seriously considering Oh, that's a lot of gold. Seriously considering making a notch apple. That's a lot of gold. But, A, it's an achievement that I don't have yet. I've been working on the achievements. And B, it gives you fire resistance on top of everything, which... I don't know if the wither shoots like fireballs and stuff at you. So it may not be really an important part of it. And he shoots little heads at you. Okay, so I've got a map here that tells me where I'm going to be doing it. I've, uh, yeah. And, okay. So a little bit of prep to do. It's, uh, it's daylight out, so let's go. Oh, I made a little fishing dock. Woohoo! Took down all the sugar cane that was there. Because we have plenty of sugar cane, two automated sugar cane farms. And, uh, yeah. So I didn't really need more sugar cane. Especially when you look over there and it's like, oh, a creeper! No, it's not a creeper. It's sugar cane. That's why some some people will tell you quite wisely. I would suggest that uh, you shouldn't plant sugarcane near your base. Okay. Hi. Give me cow. Milk. Okay. So I've got milk. I've got golden apple. I have stuff I need to make a notch apple. And I know where I'm going. And the sun's setting. So let's go back home. We will uh, all come back to you when we are in position and ready to go. Alright. See you in a bit. Alright, welcome back. I made a little clearing here. So that it would show up on the map. Um, I chose the jungle here because, frankly, no one's building out here. I think for understandable reasons and because um, it's just so hard to yeah, it's just so hard to uh, negotiate the trees and the jungles and stuff oh don't do that um, this is what I wanted to place down okay inner chest just in case I want to put some of this stuff I don't need those um, Oh, I don't know what I'm going to put in here. Nothing, really. Um, 
compass. I can probably get back home. I don't need the map. So that means potions line up here. Probably won't need these to get back home. I don't need that. So enchanted golden apple, regular golden apple. Wait, no, 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 no. Enchanted golden apple. Let's put this here. Spread these out. Enchanted golden apple. Regular golden apples. I have torches for when I'm down in there and things get dark. Soul sand. Okay. And uh, I don't freaking need this. And I don't need this. So I'm not going to throw apples. At, I'm not going to throw eggs at him. Okay. So here we go. I'm so not ready for this. And notice I have 37 levels. If I were smart, which I apparently am not, um, I would have... Uh, I would have enchanted up some new stuff. Okay, so here we go. I am so nervous. This is not even funny. <sighs> okay, and then three wither skulls. Oh, I got one. <sighs> okay. So here's the plan. No, no, that was not the plan. Okay, so I'm going to spawn this guy and then I've got this tunnel back here. A guy named uh, Pure Salvation who hasn't posted anything in a while on YouTube, which is too bad because he's a smart guy and uh, he came up with this uh, strategy. Uh, thank you, air conditioner, for turning it off and then turning it right back on. I came up with the strategy of spawning the wither and then backing down here, shooting him with bows, and then when he goes into berserker or rage mode, then switch to the sword and then do that. Um, so I'm going to be taking golden apple for the regen. I got regen potions there. I got strength potions for when we do the melee, and if things get tough, I got splash potions of healing. And then if things get really bad, then I can just drink the milk and clear all the clear everything. I think. I think that's how it's going to work. Okay, so here goes. Oh. Okay. Back up. He's going to blow. See? Oh, I got withered. Okay. Have I not done any damage to him at all? What is he doing? Where is he? Um, okay. Okay, you know what? He said sometimes this might happen. So. Might just start digging up. Come on. So we really don't need a wither loose in the world. Ah, oh, crap. Okay. Don't need that. Let's just grab that. Come on, go. Go, crap. This isn't working out quite like I wanted. The fuck is he? Is he stuck?
30 seconds of wither. Oh, we're doing okay. Okay. Um, hmm. Okay, that's kind of what I want. Okay, so he's making his way towards me. Oh. Okay. Now we just bash off him, huh? Woohoo! And there's the nether star. Okay, that wasn't too bad. It's now the middle of the night. Um, let me pick up some of these blocks. And, um, yeah. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Achievements. Um, notch apple I made. Kill the wither. Taken. Spawn the wither? I didn't even see that one. Okay. Now it's time to make a beacon. Now it's time to make a beacon. Made a little bit of mess here. And how am I going to get out? We'll figure it out. That's why I wanted these blocks. Oh, interesting. I didn't use that many potions, did I? No, I did not. Okay. Alright, well, I'm going to work on getting out of here. Because that's going to be kind of important. And uh, when I get back home and make the beacon, I'll, I'll uh, come back with you. Because this is going to be a little boring up until then. Which is fine. I probably should have brought some more uh, uh, bladders. Okay, the moon is starting to go down. Let me grab some of this stuff from here because frankly I don't need all of this in my pocket still. Let's put this in here just in case. Uh, you are going to be useful getting back. And um, home is that way. All right, the sun's going to come up shortly. It's dark in here anyway, so let's go. I hear somebody. Come on. Oh, navigating through the jungle is such a pain. Hmm. So anyway, um, so that really wasn't that bad. I was prepared. I knew what I was doing. But I've seen videos on YouTube. Hello. Of experienced players. Hello. Experienced players getting killed by the weather. Um, hi, kitty. Sorry I don't have any fish with me. Maybe I'll bring some by. Seen plenty of fish here, or plenty of ocelots here, so um, I'm very excited about that. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So I've seen plenty of uh, experienced players um, get killed by the wither, so I didn't want to get... I thought I was in good shape. I have certainly the best gear 
Um, I suppose some blast resistance on some of my armor wouldn't be a bad idea, but I've been trying to get some, but hadn't really had much luck with it. Um, so, so I suppose that would help. But uh, I was just I was just nervous, and because um, I knew it was tough. And uh, hello, Mr. Creeper. So I had never done that before. I had never killed the Wither in my single player, even though I'm probably in a spot where I could. Uh, although, um, I have not found, despite looking, I have not found a stronghold in my single player world. So, um, I have not been able to get to the end. Uh, Ender Pearls are not really part of my daily life. Uh, how do I get through this mess? So. Why do I hear sheep? Um, so, so that's not. Uh, so I'm not really as advanced in my single player world, despite having played for quite some time, months. <laughs> so uh, part of that I th I attribute to the. And I've already talked about this a bit, but sort of competition factor on the server. There's other people here, and they're doing their thing. There's nobody on right now, but I was playing, and uh, Tom was on last night. And oh. and um, you know, Tom found the stronghold before I did. I had been looking for it, but he he actually located it completely by accident. There was no he wasn't he didn't know what he was doing. <laughs> he was just digging into the ground, and he just happened to choose almost exactly the right place to do it. Um. And so that that was kind of funny. I was talking with him about it, and he was it's like, oh, no, it was a sheer dumb mistake. He had dug through and found it, and it was like, oh, wow, this is pretty cool. There's some great stuff here. Uh, chickened out about partway through because he didn't want to get lost, and he was starting to feel a little overwhelmed, which is understandable. He's a pretty... Uh, he, he started playing, I don't know, a couple months ago. He hasn't been playing that long. Um... But he did pretty good for that, and of course, this structure is just insane. It's he's got the uh, the uh, lava tower here. It's just craziness. Can't even get a good. <laughs> it goes all the way up to build limit, and then out the backside, which you can barely see here, he's got a uh, he's got a railway going. Started out just a bridge, but now he's putting rails on it, and it's over one and a half kilometers so I'm gonna have to go up and get the on a rail achievement up there because um, my yeah the uh, the railway for the the Enderman farm isn't long enough to get the achievement it's real reasonably short it's okay uh, so that is uh, that's pretty exciting so let me put all my potions away ones that I didn't use um, the potion of strength, I think, helped that fight quite a bit. Very excited about that. Healing, healing. Oh, that's healing too. Let's put this up there at least. Um, I did eat the notch apple. I did. I did. Uh, I got the I got the achievement, so that's that's good. Hello, Mr. Nether Star. Okay, so the uh, where should I stash this map? I should put it back over here. Oh, okay. Just because I'm gonna want another, I'm gonna want another uh, beacon. I think. I don't think that's unreasonable. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I'm, I don't think I'm being greedy. Okay, so I got some uh, got some cobblestone out of that, which is nice. I haven't had cobblestone in a while. Uh, andesite. You get to see my rather. Uh, Messy storage system. Got a couple ladders here. So this is all stuff that's made from wood. I do have a string chest here somewhere right there. Yep, for making trip wires and such. Do 
do this. Oh, let's go back to you. Okay. All right, so I need a few things. Oh, first off. Ah, very nice. Very nice. All right, so we need some glass and some obsidian, correct? All right, okay, let's put the milk buckets up here because you never know when you need to bake some cake or have a bucket of milk handy on you. Get my torches, my excess torches back out because. Okay, and then uh, glass is over here. Just need. Uh, okay, that'll, that'll do. When you need five, right? And then I need a few pieces of obsidian. All right, let's do this. So we got obsidian, glass, and another star. <gasps> a beacon. Oh! Sorry, I'm completely tone deaf, aren't I? All right. I'm very excited about this beacon. Okay, and then I have to figure out what I'm going to put it on because I don't have a ton of anything. I've been using iron for stuff. I wiped out my iron supply for the Enderman farm. And I think you need almost two stacks, right, for a full beacon or something. Um, my idea originally was to use emeralds. Maybe I'll bust up this emerald ore and, and see how many this gets me. Because normally, 64 with a fortune 3 pick. Um, yeah, let's try that. I'm just curious. Are you curious? Yeah, let's, let's, uh, let's see what this gets me. Oops. Okay, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. All right, so. So, yeah, so I wanted to get a beacon before they became super commonplace. Um, didn't want to do it right around spawn because, of course, the wither can, can do quite a bit of damage. Um, one of the reasons I wanted to get up on top of the nether was th I was considering doing the fight up there but then he's got like line of sight and I think that was made easier by the fact that uh, he didn't really he couldn't shoot at me most of the time because he couldn't see me he was just digging up and he didn't uh, he didn't really he couldn't see me so uh, that made it easier to sneak in get a shot off turn around sneak back out uh, so doing it on, up on top of the nether where it's just flat um, might have been uh, might not have worked so well. And then so I do I do think that uh, that approach was good. The other reason I wanted to get up there was uh, wanted to get up on top of the nether or one of the other reasons cold farm. It seems like a good place for it. Uh, okay, that's like 14 blocks. That's not too bad. Um, and then uh, I wanted to... The other reason I wanted to do it is because 181 probably won't come out this week, but it might come out next week. They're getting close. They seem comfy with it. Um, and although I haven't seen anything in the patch notes suggesting that they're planning on fixing the... Uh, the ability of ender pearling through the bedrock. Um, I don't know. I don't know that they're not going to fix it. So, so that isn't. Uh, that's not so good. So, all right. So I think I'm going to do some caving. See if I can build up my iron supply here, so I can do at least partially iron and gold. I don't need a ton of gold right now. And getting the beacon will help with mining. It will help me actually gather more iron. So, but I'm not planning on doing speed mining like complete, uh, complete, you know, 
insta mining large swaths of underground area um, right near spawn here. So this is part of my plan to uh, to move. So it's getting kind of busy here. Let's go up on my dock. Enjoy the dock. Ah. Uh, so I'm here, right? Tom's here. Vex is here. He's got this whole area here. Risk has got all this stuff here. Uh, Metal's got stuff in the mountain there. Um, Lansky's got stuff on the other side of the wall there. It's kind of hard to see. And it looks like it's starting to get dark. Uh, so he's kind of out of the way. My mine goes down here. Right, and then it heads out that way, and I've mostly been mining off that direction. So I'm out away from everybody. So I'm... I'm thinking it would be nice to get out of town and build, like, a summer home or something. And I've been scouting out, looking for stuff. And, um, not, I haven't really found anything yet, so... Uh, I, I did identify a mountain. It's quite a ways away. That would make kind of a, a cool perch for my for my sort of the the house design I have in mind. Um, but I haven't haven't done much of it there, and and that will involve multiple beacons um, for sure. So I don't know. I have to go scouting more. Um, the other thing that I want to do is spend some time out west where the portal um, where the portal near the nether um, the nether fortress uh, leads to it leads to a platform right over an ocean monument so I need to clear out that ocean monument so that's going to probably be my next big project um, I've never taken on an ocean monument before, so we've got we've got that. It'll be kind of like taking on the wither, be my first time. Um, but then beyond that, I want to actually clear the place out. I want don't want to tear it down, but I do want to like clear it out and and sort of make it so that I can use it as a base if I want. And I'm I'm sort of con considering that. So uh, so anyway, yeah, that'll do it. So that's that's going to be all for right now. Uh, thank you for watching. This was that was exciting and very cool. Um, and I will be back. And next time we will, I don't know, take on some guardians and uh, or maybe uh, whoops. Oh come on! Am I through? Yeah, I'm through. Okay, very good. And I got to work more on the uh, the Nether Fortress will show you at some time at some point um, that's that's coming along I need to build out the uh, planning on making a whiz uh, a blaze farm planning on making um, and of course I need more um, I need more uh, oh, what am I thinking I need I need more wither skeletons, wither skulls, which is the whole point of the farm. So anyway, uh, I think that'll do for now. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna take it easy for a little bit and AFK here for a little bit at the iron farm. It's kind of a low output iron farm, but figure out how many it's gonna take me. I don't need any bones right now, do I? Vex put on on-off switch here on the on the bone farm, and uh, he's got a problem with his elevator. But so I've been manually pulling stuff up. Does that work? Yes, it does. Interesting. All right. Okay. Well, again, thank you for watching. Uh, I will see you next time. All right. Bye.